All right, welcome back to another Vintage Cube Draft. I'm here with Mike B. Michael B. Hey, you. His name is Jeff. My name is Jeff sometimes. And, uh... uh oh, I was going to say a pick. And Mike also has his own mic, and I got a new mic. So two mics. Three mics. Three mics on this stream right now. What, what's, what are you picking here? I would start Is It Signet. Really? Yeah. Hmm. There's nothing like... Land tax. Meh. Meh to land tax? Every time everyone's played against it, like, yeah, you got three lands, whatever. I think it is Signate or just start the green train. <sighs> My name is Jeff. You could also start Flooded Strand, but I think Signate. I like Flooded Strand better, maybe? Keep you super open. I don't know what to do. I told you my choice. I have no idea what to pick here. You can't go wrong with a fetch land or a... It's a filthy Frank! Alright, we're taking this season. So fine. But if I swear, Mike, if we don't get anything good with this... Look, there's red cards. It works. No, not really. Not Storm's open, confirmed. <laughs> well, that does have Storm on it. You got a pack rat. Got a sword of fire and ice. So green sun's in it, but... Uh, sword of fire and ice has uh protection from the two colors that is it signet works oh well, then obviously that's a pick is there a ponder in the last pack i don't remember seeing a ponder i feel like yeah, i would have snapped I? that off what's the pick here bro did you say green sun zenith i said green sun zenith was an option i'd probably just go with pack rat though i have played the new esl expansion and it's pretty all right what up? It's there was a boy. ponder? How did I Chris not see the Ferber. ponder? What up, K-Ferd? What did you say? What did you think? Uh, pack rat. I'd go with pack rat here. Unless you want to try storm. Alright, let's go a little crazy. Let's go a little unconventional today. We got this pack rat. <laughs> Take cool mug. I really like that card. <laughs> I really enjoy that card. Exile in two apartments. There's also Council's Judgment, which is very good. Jace Bellerin. Be like Grixis, maybe? Or like a Grixis. He's probably the best card in the pack. Maybe survival, depending on your deck, but. I think Olmog's probably one of the better cards in this pack. We can also get like a Through the Breach or a. Well, I guess it's not as good with these non. I guess Jace or Ulamog. Ulamog keeps us open. Ulamog does keep us open. Jace there was is a pretty ponder. good. Okay. Oh well. Whatever. I wasn't even looking at that pack. It's filthy, Mike Mother Trucker. Take this, Jace. It's not the Lotus I want. No, it ain't. There's two other Lotuses I'd much prefer over that. Black Lotus and Gilded. Oh yeah. I don't, I don't know if it's in the cube, but it I is. assume it is. Rub my eye. So we got Thalia, got a Hangerback Walker, we got a Moat. I don't hate Moat, actually. Moat could be good. Then we're weird. Then we're like really weird colors. And super dirtily. Recruiter gets Pack Rat. That's a thing. That is a thing. That uh, is a thing. Uh, Can you just go Hangerback. D. Huh? Hangerback's so stupid though. Slow, but. You could just take that out of Dell. Yeah, that card kind of wins games sometimes. Yeah, we can steal their moxes and stuff. Sure. Oh, true name them. True name them. That's a good one. Yeah, I think that's the pick. Yeah, I don't see anything else super exciting in this pack. Yeah, none of these cards are more exciting. Him is good, but double black, and we already have two double blue spells, so I'll just stick with the blue card. We might not even be black. I do like a Steam Vents. I also do like a Chandra. What Blue think? red seems like a pretty, pretty good color combo too. How's the audio sound, guys? Mike has his own. Mike has his own mic, and I have a new mic. So let me know how the audio sounds. You think it's Chandra or Steam Vents? I'd err on the side of Steam Vents, but Chandra's really good. I think it's Chandra, course. and I think we can probably pick up more fixing lands. Adding two mana is pretty insane. Two mana? Yeah, it's like her ability. To oh yeah. Mana. So oh, Sower of Temptation. There's also an Elspeth on <clears throat> champion in this pack. Man, we ain't got no white cards. Take this good blue card. Alright. Okay. 
I'm okay, Dad. Vencer's probably the pick here. Probably. Probably. Or Colgon's command. Meh. I mean that card is good, but I'd rather just stay blue. Stay blue till I die. <laughs> till day I D I E. <laughs> oh man. I still don't know if we're really black yet, so. I don't know if you're really black yet. <laughs> I'm going to put this pack right on the side for now. So far this deck looks pretty sweet. I like all these cards. I think we need some Moxes and a Lotus and uh, an Ancestral. And then I think we're good. But we should probably add a Time Walk to that as well. Oh yeah, I, I didn't want to be greedy. He was real greedy though. But why did he say that? The whole thing was already greedy. Whoever's next to us is taking their time. Who's this? Infractor? T -t -t today. T -t -t today, Junior! Oh, well, land tax came back. Oh, barrel seems good. It's also a two drop. Magma Jet's also fine. I'll stick barrel, I guess. He makes your spells cost less. Incinerate? Mental misstep? I don't think misstep's that good. Counter's ancestral. I guess if you're countering that, it's real good. That's like the best you can do. Phoenix Fun, that green draft was definitely insane on CFB. I might have to sneeze in a second, guys, so. It's gonna be real bad. Don't do it. I, so. Oh, is it Charm came back? I think that's better than Burst Lightning here. Yeah. Alright, well, this is versatile. a pretty solid red green start, so. Red green? Uh, blue green. Blue red. Blue red. We'll get it right. Third time's a charm. Is it, is it really? Is it? Yeah, Incoming it's... boogers. Are... No one blows boogers out when they sneeze. They blow snot out, right? Like, snot is the, uh. The more. Your snot. God, I know. God, don't I know it. I'm rubber, you're snot, whatever I say, whatever you say bounces off me and you're snot. That, that was real good. Nailed it. Nailed it. What's the holdup, in, Infractor? This is too toughness or less, so we can actually get Vencer, Sower, True Name, Thada. It's actually pretty good. I don't have any fetch lines yet either, so Grim Long Man. Yeah, I'm gonna take Grim here. Nah, this guy's, from age. Yeah. this guy's fine. Sometimes he's real good. Like if we have an Ancestral, then it's draw six for four mana and get a 2 2 out of it. Or if they have Ancestral, it's also fine. Frank promised to play Necro with me when it released on D3. Now I get a commercial to remind me every time I load the stream. <laughs> oh, Case, I'm sorry. Case, we'll definitely play some D3. That'd be sick. I want to be a necromancer when I grow up. Oh, lightning helix? Dang. It's a solid card. So this is 11, 12, 13, 14. Are there only 14 cards in each pack? Oh, oh boy. It's your boy. Am I missing something? Wait, there's probably another. Yep. Yeah, you, yeah, you're hiding. Okay. Well, I wonder what the pick is. <laughs> it's probably Liliana, right? Don't, don't even. Don't even jump. What if, you, what if you misclick? I would have cried. Not even close. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. Ball off my table, though, if you really want it. Maybe. If you really want it, Nickel Ball is mine. Conscripts is brutal. Warm so is Warm Quote, though. Remember how many times we lost to Conscripts in Modern Masters drafts? Like, every time we Every time we lost, it was two yeah. A Zealous Conscripts. I think Warm Claw is a little better for our deck. Though. I think Warm Claw is better for a lot of decks. Static Suicide with the 20 month sub and Benji Boy 87 with the 8 month sub. Did those just come at the same exact moment? Man, that is insane. Nice. Another thing. Oh, no, that was the same okay. One. Yeah. Ooh, 
Warm Coil is never tabling. I'm gonna take Zealous Conscripts. Be more yeah, we're kind of aggressive. I just think it's better. Plus, like, it lets us combo. Factor Fiction? Could also be Boros Signet. Let's us splash a white card if we wanted to. Yeah, we have a lot of card advantage already. We have two Jaces. And Chandra is also card advantage. Oh, is she? Well, sometimes. Yeah, I'm going to take Boros Signet. It's just another card that lets us play Jace on turn 2-3. Two, 2-3? Three. Two, three. Tamiyo? It's also the other Elspeth. That's a double white card, man. I ain't taking a double white 4 drop. Fair. I'm going to take this Tomato. Oh, Inferno Tights. Also, Worn Power Stone. I don't think over Titan, though. I think in Titan. Titan wins games. Real fast. Yeah, like and usually when you cast out, them. If they're tapped out, man, a million damage. I was tapped out, man, once. Tapped out, man. He's a tapped out, man. It's a good song. Thank you. My daddy was a tapped out, man. What happened? He was tapped out. What? Okay. It's like you're not even listening to the story. You stay tapped out forever? Tapped out till I die. <laughs> you got this Gideon in here. You like double white Planeswalkers for four. I think it's just Caracas. We're not playing any of these cards. We're going to might not play even whatever we pick. I guess but Caracas gonna... is just a land we can put in our deck to try to deal with like... Something silly. Yeah. Like Emerful. Or bristle bed. All the mogs. Oh, it's your boy. This one? We're in the wrong colors. That is my boy. It's your boy. It's a late Imperial seal, but... I think it's just wooded foothills here. If we get a blue-red land, it's a, do it's a searcher. Yeah, that seems good. Could also be smash, but... Mm, I'd rather take a land. Take away the biggest pawn. I feel like we can get artifact stuff later. Ooh. Artifact 8, rather. Is this a Chicago song that I'm singing right now? I don't know. I didn't really hear it. Whatever, man. I don't even like you anyway. <laughs> I think this Dragonlord Silmgar, I guess. I don't think it's Gutter Snipe. We have, like, two instants and sorceries in our deck. Super dirtily, anyway. Or Grave Titan. I really like Grim Tutor as well. Jeez. Well, do you want to play the single black or the double black? Single black. Yeah. Oh, Savannah. Sick. No, just kidding. <laughs> just going to take Terminate. That's a good one. In case we're back on our Grixis train. Boss did table. Called mm. it. Wow. All right, now we're definitely on the Grixis train. That's pretty sick. Sick nasty, as the kids say. Should have done Storm. Maybe we'll storm once. What if we do the next drive? What if the next drive is is storm? Painful truths. Yeah, that's gonna draw us three. That seems pretty good. That's uh pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> you know who that is? Oh, I have no idea. Tell yeah. me more. No. But items. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord, YouTube. Nobody wants to play Elspeth. This is unbelievable to me. I would take the Raging Ravine just in case. But if we're black, Necromancy's reasonable. Alright, take that then. And it's from any graveyard? Don't you, all, you can also do it as an instant, right? Yeah. yeah if you do it as an instant, they die at the end of the turn, but... But a sweet block, though. Yeah, but also it's any graveyard, so I could just choose their dude. Oh, it's any graveyard, yeah. yeah. Uh, that card's card from a graveyard on the battlefield. Hopefully we'll pick up a way, like a, uh, some way to get black, like a... We can also get either one of these into the graveyard. Or even a sower in the graveyard is pretty good. The fact that they can hit their stuff. That's what always gets me. That's what I love about reanimation spells. The good ones, anyway. Wow, these white cards are just... Ugh, every Not the time! Power wanted. Why? Unbelievable! It's rude, really. Also, every, like, there's not a single Grix... Five dual lands, not a single Grix this one. Green, well, green, 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 white. Could take Bayou just as an easy black from your foothills. Yeah, that's actually not terrible. Otherwise, this pack is like Bolt. It's really the only thing we'd be maybe interested in. 
for never casting Massacre Worm. Ugh. I do like the Bayou and I like the Bolt. We have some removal already, though. I'd rather take the fixing. And our only removal is like, oh, I guess we did pick up this late Terminator. Alright, I'm gonna take the Bayou. Sure. Which feels weird, but. Oh, Wandering Fumarole. I think it's just Wandering Fumarole here. We don't have any fixing, so. Yeah, there's nothing super impressive in this pack. So now Wooded Foothills is a Bayou and a Mountain, so it's black and a red, which is nice. And if we can get something like. Mechanic Island right there. <laughs> Boy! Man, do we pass a Jace Friends Prodigy for it, though? That's going to be a little harder to fix. <laughs> uh, are you talking about our mana right now? I think it's still Volcanic Island. Yeah, because the deck's almost done. That's Volcanic's very helpful to our mana. Yeah, I'm going to take the Volcanic. Oh, that's a... Oh, boy. <sighs> well, we don't have a way to fetch that. Wait. Do, yeah, we don't. But it's still... You just cast it. You just, yeah. you just play it like a land. I think it's still Underground Sea here. Yeah, Cryptic is triple blue, so... Put these lands over here so I know what we're working with here. That's hard. That's ho oh, Baleful Strix. I also have a Preordain. We got a Batter Skull, too. Our mana's pretty good now. Oh, we do have two Jaces. I forgot about the other Jace. How many yeah. Jaces can we have in this deck, you think? As many as possible. I think it's either, it's either Batter Skull or Baleful Strix. We don't have a way to search out Batter Skull. So what? I'm going to take Baleful Strix. The cards are real good. That's going to be a little harder to Strix. <laughs> I see what you did there. Do you? Yeah. Okay. Well, the problem with Strix being early stall is that we might not have a black that early. I don't hate this. This card's kind of absurd. The late stone Forge Mystic? Not that it matters Flames for us. Flames on Kavu. Old FTK. Duplicant. We, we're, we've passed Batter Skull and Stoneforge, so whoever is white at this table, which I don't think anyone is, they're getting a, a, a treat. A tasty treat. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus, it's a tasty treat. How much removal do we have currently? I don't know. Sower. Chandra's kind of removal. Jason Vents are kind of removal. Kind of. Nickel Bolas, Terminate. Is we it could take a Rakdos Return. I mean, that card. I don't hate absurd. it. Yeah, we know it. I'll definitely stream ESL again. Um, I'd be down to stream that again. It was sweet. Got them Dagrons. Why do I have the song? Why is this Chicago song stuck in my head? I don't know, man. Black Cleave Cliffums. Also, a Metamorph. Oof. I think our mana is decent now. Really? It's pretty alright. I mean, Metamorph is colorless, so it's real good. You ain't wrong. Are you? I would take Metamorph, personally. Alright, I'll take Metamorph because... Because I love Man, you. Man, and we could have had that free white splash? Dang. Recurring Nightmare, is that good in this deck? Let's find out. We have Conscripts. Pretty good with Songar. What up, Yokes? Pretty good with Strix, right? Yokum said he wasn't going to watch, and then he ended up watching anyway. Typical Yokes. What'd you say about Strix? This guy? Yeah. Um, is Mystical Tutor relevant to us? Kind of. Special for an instant or a sorcery. We have a few of those, but nothing backbreaking. Like, this whole pack is just kind of meh. Could take top, but... I think Recurring Numbers is probably just the pick. I don't feel great about it, but whatever. It's either that or top, but we don't have a mirror. Old hee-haw mouth. That guy's hard to cast. Is Delver any good in our deck? No. One, two, three. Yeah, Four. okay. Just checking. I can't one of those duels be one of our colors. I don't know. I said this in pack one, my friend. I'm still going to take old hee-haw mouth. That guy's kind of versatile. It's not great, though. No. We could take Brain Maggot. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Maybe that Black Cleave Clips comes back. That would be sick. This is old Hee Haw Mouth. 
Well, hello. Hi, guys. Oh, we can sneak attack. Hmm. Or we can take the abyss. I like the abyss. We can also just keep recurring avalanche riders. Yeah. I don't know if that's that great, though. I don't know what's that great anymore. We don't play Abyss main. Tusky Bay just got passed like two packs ago. Oh, I like a V a V Nighthawk. Yeah. Double black though. Now we're looking a little heavier black. Still is very good, dude. Still is very good, dude. Oh, Pyromancer. But again, we only have Still like two not, spells, yeah. so. You yeah, take the bright. Oh, okay. You want you want to take this? Yeah, just to not have to deal with it, just in case we play against. That's people. that's it's, it's ridiculous. Possible. Whatever. We're not playing any of the cards anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, that wow. table, that's nice. I'm going to take Kavu. Kavu, 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 Chameleon. I want to take this barrel out. He kind of sucks. You don't have that many sp spells. Instant we have like three instants or sorceries. Sorceries. Aaron's sorceries. So we got two more cuts to make, and we have no mana, no like mana strength. What's he saying right now? You're, you're trying to say ramp. That's what you're, what you're trying to say. Hey, I want to say like, a signet. like free artifacts. We could bring Bolas in when it's relevant. <laughs> what? It's a little slow. <laughs> so disappointed in you. I mean, I know he's like your dad, but. You think Bolus is my dad? Oh, look at that. Oh, that guy's hideous. You right. That guy's hideous. Let's take Grim Lava Mancer out, maybe. Yeah, we only have one fetch land. And we don't have any... Well, as we, we just went over, we don't have any instants and sorceries, so... Sorceries. Could just play... Let me know how the volume level is, guys. 41 here. Oof. 41 with an 8 drop, huh? A bold move, Cotton. Well, I already said my piece on that, so... Yeah, you want to cut my favorite, my dad. My drag dad. <laughs> what about... Volume is fine, that's is, good. Is Mike's volume fine too? Because he's on a different mic. He's on a separate mic. Oh, don't do that. What do you have? No that. instant sorceries, fetches, no, th no Tusky Bay? I guess we can... What Technically, we, we could have cast a Tusky Bay if we had one. Yeah, I don't think Kroll Ultimate was in this cube, because otherwise we would have seen it at least once by now. Yeah, I am a bit louder than Mike, but that's because Mike's mic is like literally like 10 inches away from his face. Yeah, I could, I could do this. Hey. Or you can just hold it. That's a lot of work. I'm just going to leave it there. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. Or you can just put it right up here. Could that work? Maybe. Let us know if that's better. See or if worse. that's any better. We can take a Rakdos to return, maybe. I'd rather play that than Boloss. Oh I my just... god, what happened to you, man? Well, Rakdos return just wins the you? game. <laughs> so does this! Yeah, fair. Fair. I'm vetoing. <laughs> that's fine. You're driving, so. Totally vetoing. Sword by color. You only have, like,. 15 more years of experience than me in this game or something Yeah, but like what that. does that really matter? Red, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 red. Tentatively, that's okay. 4, 5, 6, 7 black. 7, 7. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That actually seems pretty decent. 977? Seven, seven? Yeah. I'm okay with this. Alright, let's see how things go.